But first tonight, celebrating ahead of the Thanksgiving holiday, a traditional gathering time for families, but also a traditional gathering time at local watering holes. In fact, Thanksgiving Eve is among the biggest days of the year for bars. And Raven Blue joins us live with more in Bay City. Hi, Raven. I am here on Midland Street where it's a little quiet right now. Not a lot of people out, I'm guessing, because it's a little drizzly. But tomorrow will be a different story because it is the pre-Thanksgiving pregame where everyone will be out here to go to their favorite bar. You know, we're ready for everyone to come out and have some fun. And Thanksgiving Eve is the biggest night for bars here in mid-Michigan, and the ones on East Midland Street in Bay City are ready for the rush. I think it's going to be, you know, a little busier than business as usual, but, uh, yeah, we're looking forward to it. We'll see a lot of folks uh, from early to late, and uh, just a traditional night for people to get out. Uh, come home for the holidays and enjoy themselves while they're in town. As families come together to celebrate Turkey Day, some members head out to their favorite watering holes before the chaos of their family gatherings. And this year, an old favorite will be opening its doors once again. We're going to have some drink specials and some other things, but for a lot of people that have been anticipating us reopening, that'll be entertaining enough. The River Rock Cafe closed back in June, but will reopen on Wednesday. We just made a decision to put the River Rock back on the map and breathe some life into the old bar and, and bring it up to speed for a new generation. Just in time for the Thanksgiving crowds. We've seen as, you know, 1,000 to 1,500 people through the doors. Um, obviously, they'll move around from bar to bar. We, you know, Middle Street area is a, a great place to, to bounce around.